Well, hello guys and welcome to part 4 of Let's Play Mother 3. So yeah, pretty much I just got inside back into the... What's that called? I forgot the name. The hot spring, yeah. So I just got back to the hot spring, that's all I did. And we're back to uh, trying to find Hinawa. Just got put by Mr. Batty. Blocking the way, bro. So I've got to beat his ass. It's another beast, Mr. Batty. Awesome, so bonus levels now, nine. I'm just gonna talk to the you know what seems to have a good head on the shoulders. Alright, got scolded. We found a baked your monster from behind. I'm gonna try to do I'm gonna do Oh my god. We don't know what happened there. So, so now he turn around. Good to finish that dude. Found a bait jam. Bitey snake or something. Mighty bitey snake. Alright. Holy crap. The thing hits hard. At least I got an antidote for that. Just gonna use some of the goods I have. Well, so yeah. I'm going to use those those snots. They're just wasting space here. So pretty much good. Talk to all those NPCs. I didn't realise it before because the flames were so intense at the time, but it looks like the area over here got hit really bad by a fire too. Oh, you don't fucking say. Yeah, that's what I didn't want to. Both the snakes at the same time. So I'm going to use the uh, straighten up. I like that. Bye. I mean, they hit so hard, they're just poison burning. Stop hitting burning! Damn it! Those fucking snakes just want to kill my dog, like last episode. Over the last episode, they might. Oh, crap. Oh, yeah, the antidote. It's another baked yam monster there. You've encountered a baked yam monster. I think that's the correct way to say it. Scary face. They're not scary enough. Oh, another big gun. This is like the best healing item I have so far. Yeah, 
dodged it quickly. More is here. Well, that's a present over here. Found some nut bread. I got it. I got it from behind. Still hurting a lot. So yeah, those snakes are going to be a death for me. Make sure I kill every dude there is here. I smashed it. I have no choice but to hit the road. So actually go up to Lighter and Fuel's house. Found a mice. So he's going to hit the road. That wasn't built for now. I know there's people that can do the combo moves and you have to put it to sleep to hear the heartbeat but I have nothing to put sleep on those guys double mighty bitey snake so he's too heat now oh my god I don't have any idea should have brought another one with me. Awesome. Now I, I can't have three things. It's better to use them. Oh, this whole episode has been me defeating the same guys over and over again. Totally got in from behind. Go big jump. Over 
the mighty bitey snake. Oh shit. Awesome, double kill. Yeah, pretty much in the area you just find Mr. Baddies. This thing, big jam. And the mighty bitey snake. So yeah, now that you can get the free antidotes, make sure you get a lot of those ones in your bag. Probably two or three is a good number to have. Because yeah, the chance of them poison you. It's like an 80%, I think, something like that. Good thing though is that they leave antidotes. If, you know, if you're lucky. Mini something I got something there. I bet that's where I have to go, but there's a frog over here, so. Yeah, let's use it. Now in that Orienda, there's a lot of, you know, scratches over here. It's just a guess, but I'll say a dragon would climb up from here. Yeah. The rugs are wasted. Apparently they're not. On me. Just go and talk to the other people over here. Yeah, that guy seemed important. So what do we do now? We've got to pass through that, don't we? Look at that dude's face, the last one. Alright, so they're going to push that tree. I'm just going to go back and talk to this old guy over here. What are you sniffing up? Alright, let's follow Boney. Yes, there is, bro. Thank you. 
Oh yeah, that's Duster. His name is... What the fuck did I call my son? <laughs> So am I, am I only going to be bony or something? I don't know. There's a cutscene. That's intense. Found Duster. I got afraid. I know. Bony's like really, really weak. I was going to be totally destroyed. I thought I was going to open all those presses. There's a storm outside and these guys are sleeping. There he is, Duster. Duster. At long last, it is time to put your thief skills you've started since childhood to the test. Now show us your wall staple technique right here, right now. This guy's like, what the fuck? Wall staple. Just do it, dude. This area looks scalable here. All right, that should do it. Blink, be careful coming up. Please, we found a red piece thing. I bet it's some part of inner wars clothing. There's a frog here and we met Duster. Looks like the rain still. Slight leg handicap, but I'll do my best. Please take me with you. So now there's the three of us, there's Duster, Boney and Blint, and I'm just going to stand here. Where don't you guys turn back with me? Alright, so... God damn it. I know we're supposed to finish. But this is going to be the end of part 4. Uh, before I make it too long. Um, well, we're going to go to that cave over there. Save with that frog and see what that piece of clothing has to do. I'll probably give it to Boney for it to smell it. So, see you, see you guys back till next episode. Sorry. Goodbye.